want to grab, and I'm going to do that dare, dare, nair, dare, nair, uh, F smasher, up B combo, right. which is cute. I mean, you know, yeah, I mean, it is Turns your stock into a goose. Yeah, yeah, but I, I'm kind of right. hoping, oh, I, this is, I think it's Giovanni versus Ozzy. Oh, okay. Is this Fox Luigi again? Again? All right, you guys, you guys, it might be too late to pop some popcorn, but you definitely want to pull up a chair you can buy and a see it as best of three. There you go. Pre-made pop. Skinny pop or any, I think you, you don't have GMO. You, 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 want, you want to top off your drinks and get ready because <laughs> we're about to see some high-quality Super Smash Brothers ready. All right, so oh, is he's going yellow fox. I, I, I like the black. I like black and Super green Saiyan. fox. All right, Elegant's got to make it. You know the one so thing, the we, one, I was gonna say, the one nerf of this game, how slow the menu is, okay? Oh, yeah. Dude, it'd be like, all right, let's go back, guys. You're like, wake me up? <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're like, <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go to the bathroom, man. <laughs> you done yet? <laughs> no. <Yeah. laughs> like, I'm only at this part. <laughs> How you gonna have eight characters be able to be played on the screen, but you can't manage the menu, <laughs> right? You. Right? Yo, yeah, okay, first of all, since we're also on topic of the menu, the costume color change, I can't, I can't, uh, I can't hit X and Y with it now. I can only use the triggers. Feels bad. Yeah, right. Se third, second, third, third change. They never load. When I pick them. You notice? That? I know. <laughs> like when you go to play online, this is like you're like, yo, did I pick the right? Because people don't understand the color of your character is more important. Like you, you get nerfed if you have the right. wrong color. Right? You hit harder. Yeah. You gotta have the right skin if you're. If like, you're if not I'm not gold Roy, like you need like, to. Yeah. Like I I'm nerfed. I'm not gold. If I'm not gold Roy. All right, we're getting Gardner oh. Luigi, and we are getting Yellow Fox. This All might right. be a serious Fox. So Giovanni, he he uh, dealt with this matchup earlier this evening, but I dare say that this My is going song. to be a hmm? favorite song in this match. And yeah, it works. All right, so this is a big one. But once again, all right, starting it off right now. Look, Elegant's trying to get in, and Giovanni knows his matchup pretty well. They fought at uh, the UCI logos a lot. However, since Luigi wants to get in, Fox is kind of able to get that read. This is Okay, it doesn't get it. It's technically not true anyway. Yeah, I mean, and it really only works. It, it's only most consistent at 0%. So one, once you're 15, 20%, you almost kind of breathe a sigh of relief against Elegance Luigi. You're like, okay, I'm not going to get one shot, but you still end up losing your stock anyway. Nice up smash out of shield from there. I think Elegance just knew he was going to go in for that grab because he didn't seem like there's any options available. Wow, okay. The matchup right now, like, wow, it's... But it looks like Elegant's running away. He's just calling out a lot of nares or empty hops with fair. And he just... Oh! I do. That's what I say. I was literally about to say that. He's just calling out to aerial approaches. And he's just correctly getting each read. Like, it's just... It's, it's nice. Weak nair to off smash the, the fox bread and butter. It's just... Right now, Elegant's kind of... Not better at shield play. He's better at the read out of shield. Like, it, it, like I, I wish I could say it like, in a more concise manner. But... Well, we're seeing a lot more follow-up attacks out of Elegance Luigi. Like, he'll go for a forward air and immediately follow up into a neutral where Giovanni may not exactly feel ready for that. And I think that's one of the best aspects of Elegance Luigi. Like, he can get two, three hits on you. Once he lands, he comes off with another attack also. It's just an onslaught that you don't see too often out of his character. Uh, one thing I, I would like to see Giovanni is for him to be able to... That, that, that's probably going to kill. I don't think... Uh, oh, he does have to jump, but... Dude, he's gonna punish that. If he's coming up with straight jump missile, he has no other options from there. This could be it. No, oh, okay. Comes with up air. Well, one thing I'm saying from Giovanni calls him out from there. It's a very close game, but it's still, you know, an elegant favor by a lot. But the one thing I want to see from Giovanni is just kind of punishing areas you know Luigi, like, cannot punish him back. You know, you know what I'm saying? I, I definitely do think there are some things he can do to exploit the, ma the matchup on a character standpoint. We didn't see Giovanni challenge offstage in the last set, and I think against someone like Elegant, you need to try to get whatever punishment you can, because otherwise you find yourself eating back airs for dinner. Sweet spot back air right there. But, the kid, the thing is, like, well, I, like... To concisely say it is, there was a moment where he got a, a narrow off uh, Luigi and he got an F tilt. Yeah. So, he backed away from there. However, Luigi was essentially not in a tumble animation, but the only thing he could have did was Nair if he was going to land. And he's like, oh, I'm going to back off from there. Right. In addition to that grab that uh, Elegant missed on the right side, he ran away from that. Luigi's fastest move out of grab is actually grabbing again, ironically. I mm. think it's like, I don't know. Still like a tether grab ring, but right. whatever. Like he should be punishing like those things more. Uh, we got wolf out technically. <laughs> the the best improvement I think Giovanni could make going into this second game. Anytime 
elegance off stage, challenge him with a shine. Ooh. Something something that he feels yeah. confident that he can get back on a stage with because I feel like he's he's just not accustomed to going way far out and like getting another forward like a forward air or something like or a neutral just to kind of confirm the stock I believe shine's still frame two from what they what they put in his match four however I completely agree with that right there little elegant missile like that, I, I don't want to say misfire but he did missile and he was just left there for a few frames of nothing and that's where shine can come in because it always pushes them out shine's hitbox knocks you out uh, right side or left side depending on where you want Oh. My fault. Nice back air is gonna connect. Right now, Elegant's looking for the dash attack. Calls the shield to pop out Ooh. yet again. Right now, back and forth dance. This is more or less an even game. Yeah, I was gonna say, Elegant's really putting on that shield pressure. Back air from there. Here comes the missile. He's gonna miss him one more time. Now he's gonna jump up B. No, okay. See, like, instances like that are when I'd really love to see Giovanni go out and hit him with a shine, or just somehow challenge his That's return go. back to the stage. Because anytime you let Elegant back up, the raw neutral play, you find yourself down stocks. I agree, but the thing is though, if Luigi's high when he's doing missile, that's a lot different from when he's lower. I, I believe it's easier to punish when he's lower because he has more options because he's higher up. So yeah. Nice! Ooh. Did he up smash or up tilt? I think that was an up smash. It's right, one of the quickest in the game. Yeah. Like, you, you can be mid combo. He's like, actually, <laughs> objection. <laughs> oh, oh, come on, man. We, we, no, we're, we ain't getting Phoenix right. Don't teach me like that. Phoenix <laughs> right. All right, let's see. We're back to essentially, wait, you know, even game. Nice to have Smash read from there. Luigi has no real punish from there. But like you said, once he resets the, uh, he, once he resets the control and get, loses stage control, like, Elegant just kind of just chops him up. It's not, not, not literally, but. Right. You know. Well, maybe literally. I feel like keeping <laughs> Elegant at, in a disadvantaged state is definitely going to be the key to success here. Of course, that's a pretty obvious statement, but just the way we've seen this game go, one of the weakest things is just Giovanni just allows Elegant to get back on stage for free. No Dash way. Attack, oh, that no. does kill these days. <laughs> Not at 127, but it can send you off. Okay, do you know why he died there? It's because he side beat so early. And side beat actually sends you back a little bit. The same with Diddy Kong. Oops. If you side beat with Falco, Fox, or Diddy uh, at stage, you actually go back a little bit, and then you go forward. So he killed himself by doing that. The more you know? Uh, the, uh oh, it's a little bit uh -huh. false for us. But one thing, the other... Oh, well, they're still playing. I okay. okay. They, they, they knew. They waited. They waited <laughs> I like that. that. Very kind to the commentator. <laughs> oh, calls him out with the jump, for, jump NATO. Wow, what a read. He's realizing that Giovanni's constantly recovering high, and uh, no Trump or anything. Like that's that's yeah. the one thing. It's just like he's kind of just like letting Luigi recover for free. And before the very first thing we talk about of the day is like how essentially Luigi has a not a Terrible recovery, but a very. Oh, that's, that's, that's did you see Fox's game. face? He looks so confused. <laughs> he was like, "What? What happened to your old ground?" He's like, "Did I just get beat by a vacuum cleaner?" 